All right, so away we go. Looking forward to the trip. Uh, I think this is the sort of adventure that we have with having a caravan on the back, isn't it? Yeah, you're not wrong. There's something about it, isn't there? You, you hook it up and you drive, and you seem to have a big sigh of relief as you drive out of town. And we're off. A third wheel and his two new mates on a road trip to the Macedon Ranges. Isn't it nice to be rolling into somewhere where you've got absolutely no expectation? They generally pop up and give you some bloody good memories. Nah, completely agree. It didn't take long once we got off the Western Highway exit for Lindell to become an impatient backseat driver. I'll be there yet, I'll be there yet. <laughs> Worse than the children. Round to the left here. Oh, steep grade, use low gear. Here's some advice. Better than it running away and trying to cook your brakes on the way down a hill. I like just dropping it down to the gear and just being comfortable all the way down. Yeah, they make it easy for driving with you know, heavy loads behind now. It's kind of hard to believe. We're only, what, an hour, hour and a bit from Melbourne? There's a lot of timber through here. It's like um, they've never come through and really cleared this country. Yeah, I think that the beauty about out here is there's so much other countryside um, that they really don't need to sort of destroy the hills. They've kept them as national parks. Right. That's probably why this area is really so popular, eh? Another 15 minutes and we finally arrived at Blackwood Caravan Park, a haven in the middle of the bush. It's uh, quite the sight watching you in the mirror coming around that corner. There's a big lot of black caravanning cars. I've got a bit of a habit of making things stand out a little bit. You sure you're not compensating? <laughs> I think you just uh, upset Lindell then. Now the drawback of having such a big van is having to reverse park, but Brian knew exactly where to put it. Whoop, whoop. As we were unhitching our vans, Brian and Linda were joined by Polly and her mate Penelope, who both wanted the cracker. Thank you, box. Excuse me. Goodbye. There you go. Have a look out the window. There you go. 